In today's video, we're going to demonstrate the difference between the local navigation and body frames in the ADIS 16480 IMU using the IMU evaluation software package. When using the local navigation frame, the accelerometers will respond to dynamic acceleration but will not respond to static orientation changes. On the waveform recorder, the red and green lines in the middle screen, middle part of the screen represent the X and Y axis responses for the accelerometer, which settle back to zero G regardless of orientation. The blue line represents the Z axis, which settles back to one G regardless of orientation. Using the register access menu, we can access the EKF configuration register to switch from the local navigation frame to the body frame. Writing a hex number of 208 to this register makes the switch while preserving all other configuration settings. Well, as we return to the waveform recorder, we can see that the accelerometer now responds to both dynamic acceleration and the orientation changes with respect to gravity. As we close this out, we want to take a moment to thank you for your interest in high-performance inertial MEMS products from Analog Devices.